Okay, we're we're rolling. Are we rolling? We're rolling? We're rolling in it? Just like how I'm rolling in your new merch? Hell yeah, brother. Check out the merch store. Link in the description. L link in the description. Check out Webweaver's merch. He just dropped it. All the Mourn art is beautiful. Like, I'm wearing one right now. I can't believe you sent me this special copy. Uh, anything for you, buddy. Aw, oh, thanks. I so know what are we do doing again? Same. Oh, uh, yeah. I so we got this. That's the Amulet of Transformation. It's the next really like jump scare looking at us. <laughs> Fucking hell, I just jumped in my chair because I was like, oh, yeah. All right. I so, forgot how sudden things in this game are. The Get dude. him! Go, Halligan, fuck him up! Get him! Fuck him! Oh, wait, I was uh -oh. phrasing. Oh. <laughs> So, oh. I think we just leave now and show this to, uh, Blake, right? I, I I would assume so, unless, like, the captain has anything else to say. Oh, no. We have to have the captain tell us stories. The captain's gonna tell us, like, ten stories about, Oh, my cat! It's so wonderful! It's amazing! Have you seen my cat? Where is it? Oh. Uh. uh... Oops. <laughs> I like how Halligan isn't even on screen when he comes in here. Like, you have to have him run on screen. <laughs> it's like a fucking play. You're on, you're on! Shit, shit! I'm not even in my full costume! I'm only 10 pixels in! If this was a play, Halligan Whoa. would get, like, the pole would come out from the side of the screen and just drag him into the abyss. Totally, but he's still getting top billing. True. Have anything to say I about this? I thought it wouldn't work like that. True. Okay, we don't just transform the fucking the harbor master. <laughs> we can't upgrade him before the the ship ride. Also, music needs to go down just a little bit. Oh, okay. There we go. Monsieur le Capitaine, what can I do for you? Are we just gonna leave? Yeah. When are you leaving? <laughs> Let's get out of this no. shit country. Are you <laughs> hey, Plunger, you want to leave France? Oh, hell yeah. Yes, then come aboard. Oh, oh. Wait, whoa! Wh We're in a room. We are in a room. But we've, we've never entered this room before. I'm not tired. This... Okay, Helen. You're not. What, what are you then? There, there's a red towel. There's a door. The fucking are we pixel mining? Oh, oh, how again? How again? How again? What are you? What are you doing, buddy? What are you? Uh, what are you doing? All right. Oh, I think that was a cutscene. I don't think I need to change my clothes just yet. He's packed okay. a change of clothes? He's packed, like, there are towels and extra shoes and socks. Fucking... He's got the drip. He's got the drip. Drip Halligan when... Drip Halligan art when... Oh, no. Oh, man. Maybe you could add that to your merch line. Oh, yeah, maybe, maybe. Yeah. Oh, oh. oh. <laughs> Hold on, does he lose his corporeal form when he goes to wash his hands? Absolutely he does. He'd be like the uh, the witch from A Wizard of Oz. Gets in contact with water, evaporates it. Oh! oh. <laughs> evaporates immediately. Halligan, where'd you go? Oh, there you are. I think I'd better leave the amulet in the cabin. I might lose it otherwise, or it might be stolen. But where can you I- You are the only on the people on the ship, I thought. And also, he he's not gonna lose the fishing rod, the scarf, the fingerprint powder, the bone that he's still carrying around. His gloves, he, he's only worried about losing this. Oh wait, is are we actually gonna be capable no, of wait. losing the amulet? Okay, wait, put it in the closet. Throw her in the closet. Is that empty mm, shelf just for that. it? Not a good idea. Not a good idea. There's nope. no point in that. It, that doesn't work. They would have surprised me if it had worked like that. Okay, our logic I, I is being questioned. 
do we flush down the drain? Oh, wait, wait, the scarf. Put the, the amulet in the scarf. Else. There's no point the, in that. What if we do it the other way around? Oh, Because we know right. that's... You're right. <laughs> I should think about it again. Nope. Um, Evidence bag baggie? makes sense? That's futile as well. A roll Fuck of off. plastic bags <laughs> to secure evidence. I feel like maybe this is put... evidence in an ancient druid conspiracy. B maybe we put the bags on top of the thing instead? There's no point in that. Alec oh, disagrees. Put it in the fucking vent. <laughs> That's kind of sus like in Among Us. Not a good idea. <laughs> oh. Not a good idea, he fucking left. He's doing it! Oh my fuck! Halligan! A perfect hiding place for the amulet. No one will find it there. It's not like it'll bounce around the fucking air vents or anything, but yeah, sure. <laughs> perfect spot for I'll it. Go and get some There's just a little air. turbulence. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Immediately hit with boat. God, what's been going on here? Someone's broken into my cabin and searched through all my things. Huh. The amulet. Where's the amulet? Oh the no! The emperor didn't have Where it on him. Where did you go? The amulet. Where's the amulet? It's been stolen. The amulet I of don't kings. Believe it. You have to take I, it to Martin. I I can't believe the game the literally put you in a cutscene. Where's the amulet? It's been stolen. I don't believe it. Put you it. into a room to just lose the fucking amulet. Does this room only exist for the sole purpose of you losing the amulet? I, I think so. Is, is there nothing else that we can get here? We, we can't take this lamp and beat someone to death with it later? Okay. I, I would. Nah, we'll, we'll just poison Blast them. It. The thief must still be on board, but we're pulling into the harbor. I'll never catch him now. Well, better just give up. What kind of fucking Debbie Downer are you? <laughs> And we're, we're, we, we could go back to France. Maybe they found it in France. I mean, I, I wasn't... I feel like... Oh. Uh... I'm just kind of fucking, like, dumbfounded by whatever the fuck just happened there. Yeah, um... Uh... I, I don't know. I, I mean, I would say we Blake? go to the police, but we are the police. <laughs> Sir, how do I stop crime if I am the crime? <laughs> All right, we have to ring the bell Mr. First. Blake? Blake? Hello, Mr. Blake. I'm back. And? Did you find the amulet? That's a long story. It's a lot. You put it in a fucking vent and lost it, you idiot! Well, go on then. I can't wait to I'm hear what happened. I found the amulet. <laughs> it was walled up in the Lord's mausoleum. Really? It really does exist then. And you've got it. Uh -oh. Show me. Uh oh. Uh. Well, I did have it, but it was stolen from me. Stolen? How did that happen? No idea. I hid it in my cabin during the crossing. Someone broke in and rummaged through all my luggage. Was anything else missing? No, not a thing. Someone must have been following you. I didn't notice anyone. Who could have known I'd been looking <laughs> for an You didn't notice the fucking dump. Certain people may be taking a great interest in your investigations, Mr. Halligan. Do not underestimate the power of the druids. Is it Lowry? Holy shit, he's on the case again. Power of the Druids. I can't believe all three of these answers are from a fucking moron. <laughs> I, d I, I mean, listen, he is a human beetle. He sure is a human beetle. Flip him on his back and he's got no fucking clue what to do. Um... I haven't met anyone who's looked like a druid so far. Nobody's looks like they've been eating babies. I haven't like... met anyone who looked like a druid so far. No, no, Mr. Halligan. 
You won't recognize the inheritors by their cloaks and sickles. They're people, just like you and me. They could be powerful industrialists, high-ranking politicians, or influential military men. People in key or gamers. Of society. Oh, what can I do? Shit. I can't possibly check up on the entire upper class of British society looking for a couple of druids. No. But it may be worth your while to keep an eye on groups of neo druids. N neo? If anyone I, tries to justify I, I fucking to hate that. Parents, they will. Oh, we have to ask. Neo druids? What are they? There are a number of groups around claiming to be the druids' rightful successors. They're organized in orders like Templars or Freemasons. Templars. Templars, okay, okay, cool. Tell me more about I don't want to know more about these like said, neo druids. The neo druids try to live their lives according to ancient druid ideals. They Some eat every fifth lot of baby just to be well, sure that they're the real are some druids. Really dubious associations going around combining the druids' customs with occult rites. Rumors say that there is such a sect at large somewhere in London. In London, you said? Do you know where I might find these people? I've no idea. All I know is that the only people who know anything about the order refer to it as the circle. Of the druids! Holy shit. Thank you, Mr. Oh. Blake. I'll see what I can make of it. Good. If you have any more questions, don't hesitate to call on me. Anytime you like. Oh, one more thing. Just one. We're doing the Columbo? Oh, oh, just, just one more thing, just Mr. Just one more Blake. thing? Yes. I get the impression this business could get pretty dangerous from now on. Yes. Very likely, Mr. Halligan. It may be safer for both of us if we let someone else in on the matter. Please call Melanie Turner in Oxford and tell her the whole story. Make sure she learns everything you've told me. She works at the Anthropological Museum. Her number's in the phone book. And tell her I'll get in touch with her myself as soon as possible. Would you do that for me? Of course, Mr. Halligan. Good luck. Make sure you put it on a public phone call. Go through the operator and everything. We need to make sure this gets there to the best way possible. No way an operator could be a druid. Oh shit! Well, I mean, he did say high society people, and yeah, not to high not society to slander people could be checking your fucking calls. <laughs> Dude, she could be paid by druids. Oh shit! You're right. You're right. Uh... uh do we go to the museum or go back to the police department to report the crime? <laughs> uh, well, Blake's going to contact Melanie for us, so I feel like we should go to Scotland Yard. All right. Look at him go. There he goes. Halligan, into my office at once. Oh, uh -oh. oh that doesn't sound good. Um. Uh -oh. Oh, I can't control Halligan. He's going. Oh, oh, this is a cutscene. Oh, shit. Uh-oh. Halligan, come on in. I suppose we hey, should be boss. glad that you drop in now and then. What's the matter, Chief? You know, what Halligan, you I was just asking myself what you've been doing. I've been investigating, Chief. Well, have Bro. you? And do you know what I've been doing? I've been dismissing loads of press people, worried citizens, and politicians from my office. The phone hasn't stopped ringing since this morning. The mayor's been to my office, and I haven't seen much of you. When do you expect been to come France. up with results? <laughs> You'll get a report at the end of the week. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I mean we, we gotta dab on him. We, we gotta, we gotta. <laughs> You'll get a report at the end of the week. The end of the week? Why not at the end of the month or at the end of the year? I want the results on my desk tomorrow morning, Halligan. And now, I want to know where you've been all this time. I told you, fucking France. You'll find out when you read the report I'm going to write. Don't be impertinent, detective. As your chief, I'm entitled to ask you about the results of investigations and your proceedings whenever I like. Yes, chief, of course. That sounds better. Otherwise, I could have you write a report about every single step of your proceedings, and I think you know that. Very well, then. I was visiting an expert on druids. You were what? <laughs> Alligan, have you lost your marbles? You're not supposed to be indulging in your hobbies. You're supposed to be solving the skeleton murders. Is that all? Is that all? No, that is not all. One of the phone calls this morning was from the 4th District in Oxford. Uh-huh. And? A beggar has been to see them. 
He claimed oh. somebody had oh. first put him to sleep. <laughs> and oh, oh, shit! Oh, shit! No, a man who calls himself Detective Halligan. Our colleagues looked into the social <laughs> personal database and guess what? We found a man by the name of Detective oh, Halligan. And he works for my department. What do you say to that? <laughs> when did you receive the phone call from our colleagues? When did you receive if the phone the call from our as colleagues? A colleague. Less than half an hour ago. Have you any idea how embarrassed I was about the affair? The colleague I talked to said that the beggar still had some of the substance he'd been knocked out with. Medical alcohol with apple juice. Uh. Please tell me you didn't do it. I had nothing to do with it, Chief. Honestly. <laughs> well, I hope so. For your benefit. <laughs> now on, I expect you to start looking into the case of hand. <laughs> I've never heard more of a fucking bull face lie! Shh. Oh my god, the beggar must be mistaken. We gotta drive that down hard. What is he, a bum? Jeez, no way be he'd be telling the it's truth. A mix, a mix up? I hope so. If these accusations turn out to be true, you can spend the rest of your professional life washing police cars! Okay, Chief. I read you. Indeed? Excellent, Detective. Then get out and do your job. And, Halligan, if I should hear that you are conducting your investigations in any dubious or illegal way, I'll take you off the case immediately. Understood, Chief. <laughs> Dude, wait till he finds out we went to France like six times. <laughs> <laughs> and put it on the company tab. Oh, I thought we were paying for it with the beggar's change. Uh... Oh shit, we don't have it anymore, so maybe. Uh-oh, I accidentally clicked out of the oh. game, it might crash. Oh, 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 uh -oh, uh -oh, uh -oh. Uh oh, Are we in? Are we uh -oh, live? Uh -oh. We're here, we're here, hello? Okay, hold on, hold on. Save game? Oh. Yeah, 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 YouTube, amulet stolen. We're, we're safe, we're good. We're safe? Okay, okay. For now. Fuck, I can't, I can't believe it came back to bite us in the ass! <laughs> Are we gonna get you? Wait, shit, the cat! No, we don't have we the cat anymore. We abused the cat in fr no, but we abused the cat in France. Do you think that'll catch up with us? <laughs> I mean, we are in possession of a, of a 700 franc stolen fishing rod, so... Oh, fuck, I forgot <laughs> about that. <laughs> we shit! We were gonna go report a crime to our colleagues. Meanwhile, we are the crime. <laughs> but sir, I am crime. <laughs> so, I mean, I I actually I'll, I'll be honest. It's been like several a couple months since I watched the Mandalore video, so I don't really remember what we're supposed to be doing now. Um, maybe. I don't know, I guess we can just talk oh. to people. Yeah, let's let's go see who else knows. Yo, what up? What up, floating Lowry? Oh. <laughs> well, what up, floating Lowry's heat register? What is it this time, Halligan? Oh, you can ask him about the circle. Have you ever heard of an organization called the circle? The circle? Is that somehow connected to the crop circles? Okay, forget it, Lowry. Um, we could try to steal his. Wait, system. who's Detective Stryker? Uh, he was in the uh, document that you get for having the physical copy of the game. He helped Lowry with his investigation. Wait, so it's useless? I believe so. Yes, but we can ask. Where can I find Detective Stryker? Stryker, on holiday. Why? He still owes me some money. Oh. Maybe he knows about the circle. Maybe he knows more yeah. about the organization called the circle. Oh, you're still going on about that, are you? Well, if you want to hear my opinion, Halligan, those strange crop circles were drawn in the fields by a pensioner. By the way, um, what's that got to do with the skeleton murders? It's Dear called God police. Lowry, just tell me where I can find Stryker. It's called police investigation work, Lowry. Maybe you should try it sometime. He still owes me money, Lowry. I he can't pay you back money. unless Somebody he pays owes me you back. you money, that makes a change. Usually it's the other way around, because you play cards just as badly as you investigate. Well, tough luck True. for you, Halligan. Stryker isn't here. Um... 
All right, I'll talk at you okay. later. I'll talk to you later. Lowry. I love how he always puts his hands behind his back and he like puffs out his chest a little bit whenever he says later, Lowry. Oh yeah. Uh oh, dog. Hello. Oh. We we gotta go. Dog gaming. Dog gaming potentially. We might go into pause mode. Who knows? But we're not in pause mode yet. How's it going, Janet? Oh wait. Okay. Wait. Maybe we should check our office. We we can go there right, after we say course. hello to Janet. Hi, Janet. Hello, Janet. We drugged a beggar. <laughs> what about my <laughs> database inquiry now? I don't like to repeat myself, Brent. Have you not been nope. listening? Yes, of course I have. No. Well, I've got fucking lead in my all, ears and you? a beggar's sure. money in my in pocket. That case, see you later, Brent. Good. See you later then. Take your time, Brent. Damn. I that is still so fucking savage. She's so rude. Take your time. Everybody is rude to Halle. Oh, it's beeping. Oh, hello, beeper. I'd better leave that here. Oh god, I haven't used one of these things in eight million years. Brent? I haven't used one. Hello. Is that you? It's your mother. Oh, okay, I was gonna know, ask who the I fuck are these? these? Modern talking machines. I haven't heard anything from you for months now, Brent. Is that any way to treat your mother? I've joined the cult. Aunt Annie's celebrating her 75th birthday at the weekend. We have both been invited. We're going to eat you fresh child's blood. Won't you? Brent? And please, wear something smart. Do me a favor. Oh, God. That's all I need. He hasn't... He hasn't called his mom in months. Look, he's been busy. He's been gambling it all away. Oh. Hello, sir. This is uh, Al's Pizza Palace. Your account from last quarter has not yet been paid. It amounts oh. to two hundred and seventy-five pounds. <laughs> Please see to it. With that is an absurd <laughs> amount of pizza. Two hundred and seventy-five pounds. Wow, that's my personal record. Record? Who opens a tab at a fucking pizza place? <laughs> hello, Mr. Halligan. This is Melanie Turner speaking. I was oh, wondering hello, why Melanie. I hadn't heard from you, but Mr. Blake just called and told me everything. I'm out and about quite a lot at the moment, and you may have difficulties trying to get me on the phone. But if you need me, just leave a message. See you later. All right. Let me give you some good advice, Detective Halligan. Don't interfere with our affairs. It wouldn't be very... healthy. What? Who was that? Just, was that a, just just some a threat to, to a I, police I think officer? It's... He just threatened an officer of the law. What was that? Was that a druid? <laughs> or or just somebody that Halligan's poisoned? It might be one of his poison victims. <laughs> All right, what's this next one? Halligan, this is Miller. Damn it, where are you? Do I have to speak to this damned answering machine if I want to get hold of you? If by any chance you happen to turn up in this department, I want to see you in my office. Miller speaking. I've had enough. You better come to my office as soon as possible. Did you get that? The chief. I'm glad I've got that behind me. I never use the receiver. That thing is just too heavy. Using the loudspeaker is much more comfortable. Uh oh. Wonderful. All right. I don't think that worked. No, no, I don't think it did work. Okay, so we've heard from everybody. We're being threatened by our mother. 
a druid invited us to dinner with our grandmother. Um, and we're on our, notice. We're on notice, and for yeah, poisoning a civilian. Wait until he uh, finds out about the stolen merchandise from France. Illegally until he finds out the, the multiple border. cruise ships to France. <laughs> <laughs> I'd better leave that here. Um. Fuck. Maybe. So I think there there's a couple of things that we haven't resolved, and that is, uh, getting that information thing from uh, the information database thing. And then yeah. uh, I think we can also try to steal Lowry's scissors and he gets mad at us. Is that something we tried to do? Uh, let's, we... see. let's just let's just bug him. Let's bug Lowry. Go. Yes. yes. Might I ask you what you think you're doing? I'm I just borrowing your scissors. your scissors. Just for five minutes. Forget it. For heaven's sake, it's only a pair of scissors. Only a pair of scissors? Well, if it's only a pair of scissors, I'm sure you won't have much difficulty in getting a pair from somewhere else. Am I right? All right, then. Keep them. All right, let's 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 talk to Larry more. We always like talking to Larry. Yeah, we, we do like talking to Larry. What is it Lowry. this time, Halligan? Okay. So we asked the other ones... Let's get the date with Janet. Let's just really push it. Because th th why would he date somebody like that? He's a perfect man. He wouldn't date such a bitch. I'd really like to know how a braggart like you managed to get a date with Janet. Well, you know what, Halligan? Women do like a winner, don't they? Little Janet is no exception. We went to the palace yesterday. What was showing? The new Schwarzenegger film. You know how to handle women, don't you? Of course. Janet said she found it disgusting, but I know for a fact that she was very keen on it. Women are like that. Do you understand? All right, um... I would have thought Janet had more sense. Yeah, well, fucking belittle our, our main sense. man. Oh, actually, I think she's got very good sense. That's why she always refuses to let you take her out somewhere. She prefers to go out with a man who doesn't dress in rags, dragged out of rubbish bins, or eat the same pizza every day. Did she say that? Hey, I take offense to that, man. I have $275 tabs at pizza. And I go to the cinema with Janet. That's the way things work. Oh, I'm sorry, old boy. Oh, we have the Columbo drip, though. Lowry doesn't know what we, he's talking about. We do. About. What amazes me? I love me the more a woman um, like her should find your uh, boring stories about trip on. cars, oh, yeah, sports, and action films yeah. so entertaining. Halligan, I'm sure you didn't come to tell me that. What do you really want? Could, Could I, I just use your phone? phone? Haven't you got your own telephone, Halligan? Yes, but there's something not quite right with it. No dialing tone. Is that it? What's your How do you know? Or... Yeah, we can ask that. Yeah. How do you know that? Yeah, Someone in accounts has had a look at the department's telephone bills, Halligan. And you're the record holder by a very, very wide margin. Your phone will only work internally from now on. Janet told me that when we went to the cinema. Where do you keep calling to, anyway? The Caribbean? I don't think that's got anything to do with you, Lowry. Oh, yes, OK, of course, sure. It's none of my business. But if you think that you can make your phone calls from here, you're dead wrong. Tell me, Lowry, what's your extension? 196. You know that. Yes, right. i just forgotten it. I don't phone you so very often. Yeah, and that's the way I like it, Halligan. Don't you dare start ringing me up and getting on my nerves. So we can now call Lowry okay. on the phone. I'll talk to you later, Lowry. Now, I have an idea. I think you know I those also... scissors we're pretty keen on taking? Oh, these ones right here? Hey, yeah, I've these ones? Enough. Get your paws off my scissors, will you? <laughs> he just runs out the office. <laughs> <laughs> Let's fucking threaten him with <laughs> call number five or whatever. Oh, yo, let's go. Let's do it. Let's fucking use the speakerphone other shit. Let's do it big. It's this one, right? Miller speaking. I've had enough. 
You better come to my office as soon as possible. Did you get that? So what? Do I just do this and then one nine six? Scotland Yard, Detective Lowry. Play it. Miller speaking. I've had enough. You better come to my office as soon as possible. Did you get that? Oh, of course, sir. I'm coming. I'm on my way. Let's rush out! We got a limited amount of time! We gotta grab those scissors! Time puzzle! Oh my God. <laughs> he tried to fucking skip his way along. Let's go! <gasps> Let's go! The scissors! Let's fucking go! Let's go! Oh no! No, I clicked out of the game! No, I clicked out of the game! No! 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 He's gonna come back! He's gonna no. come back! Oh. Oh. Wait, hold on. Wait, hold on. Oh no, what the fuck? What? Oh, 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 we're free. There was an error Let's that popped up, but we're free. An error popped up? <laughs> yeah, no, an error message popped up. Uh... These are Lowry's paper scissors. He must be looking for them. Wait. What the? Okay, I, I think the successful... I want to reboot the game now because of that. Um, But I've saved. Yeah. We're going to call it here for this episode. We've got Lowry's scissors. These are Lowry's paper scissors. He must be looking for them. His paper scissors, sorry. So thanks for watching, yeah. everybody. Stay safe out there. Bye. Hey, grab that merch! Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Grab the merch. Link in the description.